So I wanted to share a quick tip on how you can prevent your users from double submitting or double clicking a button, causing it to fire off multiple mutations to your server. So this thing is actually easily preventable with the mutation component from Apollo. So they have something built in that makes it easy to use so we can prevent this problem. But first, let me show you what I'm talking about. So here I have a to-do list where you can add to-dos. So I basically just type it in here and we can click add to-do. It's a little slow and then it's gonna pop up the to-do. And so the code for that's over here. We can see I have an Apollo mutation component. Um, I'm passing in my mutation and then we're doing an update to the store. Um, and then I just have a form that's getting submitted when this button is clicked. Um, so that's the gist of it. And the problem happens when uh, let's say I want to go grocery shopping and that's my to do and let's say I click on this and then I click on it a few times because I wasn't seeing it pop up right away and now I've just submitted this three times and I didn't really mean to do that right so how can we prevent the user from doing this well there's another value that you can get off of this mutation over here so if we come to the mutation we have the add to do function that we're getting in the second option bag over here, or object, there is a thing called loading. And basically this is a prop that's initially false. And then when you call add to do, it will become true. And then when it's done loading, it will become false again. So what we can do is we can say disabled is equal to loading. So when loading is true, the button here is going to be disabled. And so basically what's going to happen is when I now do uh, trip two and I click add to do, you know, it won't let me click the button again. And so this prevents me from double submitting it. I've clicked it once. I can see it's loading and now it pops up again here. This is also nice to use if you want to display to your user a spinner or something. And we didn't have to add any set state logic. We can just use the built in loading from Apollo off of the mutation component. So there you go, quick tip for you guys on how you can handle that and prevent your users from double submitting stuff.